guys, what's going on? It's Paul Ravella here, ProPhysique.com, and I thought I'd do a little update video to catch you guys up on what's been going on the last couple days. So I'm officially 10 days out from getting on the NPC Men's Physique stage at a show in South Florida called the NPC Outdoor Classic. If you haven't watched my previous videos, the goal there is to get a national qualification. It's a national qualifier, and then I'll be able to compete at the uh, Arnold Classic Australia while I'm over there with Lane doing some seminars and camps and stuff so that's my current goal uh, how have the last couple weeks been going really well I've, I've taken a new approach with with my coaching business being very busy this time of year I've been being more opportunistic with my time in the gym so I've been doing a gym session during the day and then going back at night when I get caught up on work and I find that going back and doing my cardio or whatever it is I want to do at night allows me to kind of feel refreshed, go back in, kill it again. I come back home and I'm hyped up again and so I'm able to work again. Keeps the mental juices flowing. I really like this approach. Uh, in previous years, in 2012 when I did a contest prep, I had a job that I had to be at from 7 to 5 every day. So it was very limiting. I only had a limited amount of hours that I could go to the gym right now it's kind of up to me uh, so some other stuff that's been going on my wife just got um, just recovered from her hernia surgery so she's actually been training in the home gym so she, she trained here today uh, today I'm actually I usually train at powerhouse North Tampa that's where I love to train my favorite gym but today I'm actually going to uh, LA Fitness um, and I'll explain why in just a second so LA Fitness is a closer to like a health club gym um, for, for those of you guys that are familiar with LA Fitness. It's a great gym, has all the equipment that you could need. Doesn't have quite that environment that a uh, powerhouse has, but the other day we came out to the garage and found that our water heater right here, see that? See those burn marks? So we found the there was flames coming out of there, so I immediately turned off the gas, turned off the water heater, called our uh, called our heating guy and uh, he came out and told me that the um, must have been a leak inside the water heater it uh, it, it was it was burning so it actually burned up the circuits inside the the water heater so right now I have no hot water in my house and um, I know you guys aren't gonna cry for me because I live in Florida but it has been like the last couple nights like in the I don't say the high 30s maybe low 40s in the in the day right now it's in the 60s which that's beautiful weather for a lot of people, but for Floridians, that's freezing. So, uh, as you can see, I'm dressed pretty much, I don't know how to dress when it gets cold. I'm wearing tights, uh, I'm wearing this badass Core Nutritionals uh, hoodie that Doug Miller gave me a couple years ago that I rarely get to wear because it's rarely below 70 degrees. But So for today, I'm going to go to LA Fitness, um, take advantage of their really nice showers and locker room and stuff so I can get a shower after I train. Today I have scheduled like a quad, quad dominant lower body day, and then uh, some cardio. And um, I can't take this camera. This is my big old Canon EOS. I can't take this in the gym. So what I'm likely going to do is bring my camera phone in, maybe get some pictures. The other good thing that LA Fitness has is good locker room lighting for pictures. You know, I was a member there for years, and that's where I did all my all my update pictures from all my contest preps past. So. That's where I'm at with today. I'll uh, I'll update you guys, include some um, some pictures and videos of where I'm currently at at 10 days out. I plan to do a refeed day tomorrow, and then probably uh, Tuesday or Wednesday before the before the show. Uh, I find that I'm looking the best if I do a larger refeed about three days later. I'll time it just right. Some other exciting news. Uh, Lane Norton decided he's going to come with me to to my competition. Uh, so he and I are driving down on Friday, getting a hotel room, so that'll be nice. We'll get to manhang, you know, it's, uh, it's, he's one of my closest friends, but with his schedule, it's, you know, sometimes we don't get to see each other that often, other than a couple hours at the gym. And um, so it's gonna be really nice to, you know, get a road trip in, hang out, get on stage, compete, and we'll be heading back Saturday. So that's what's going on here. I uh, appreciate you guys watching. Um, and uh, I hope you enjoy my update footage, pictures, and stuff. And uh, 10 days out, looking forward to, to see what, what happens. Oh, hey guys, what's going on? So I uh, didn't bring my other camera, so this is my cell phone, my iPhone. 
uh, camera. Wanted to just talk about, um, so because I couldn't train at a, or because I can't shower at home, I decided I would go to LA Fitness today to take a shower. And uh, although I don't train here very often, the gym equipment is, you know, very nicely kept. They have a great, uh, like, locker room, shower facility. So I did enjoy myself. I did, like, a quad dominant lower body day. I did some hit cardio. And uh, I think my last refeed day was Friday, and today is Wednesday, and I am so flat. Like, I, I hit a few poses in the locker room, and I just felt terrible. So uh, I know it's part of the process, but it's still, you know, mentally tough, and you don't see yourself at your best, and you're 10 days out from a show. Um, just gonna get the glare off of here. Yeah, so I think tomorrow I'm gonna do a refeed day, and then based off how I look each day successively, that's how I'll time my peak. Uh, I'm not gonna get super, super aggressive tomorrow, probably 400, 450 grams of carbs, and uh, go from there. Um, I'll show you some pictures. I took some locker room selfies today, and then I'll try to take some tomorrow with a pump, maybe, um, because I'm probably gonna have to come back here. I don't think our water heater is gonna be fixed. Uh, that quick so anyway guys that's it um, sitting in the parking lot getting ready to drive home and I see Lane's car in the parking lot but uh, his wife trains her so she might be here anyway uh, that's that I'm probably gonna come back tonight and do another cardio session at powerhouse um, just cuz I was pretty run down at the end of this and uh, I'd like to get one more little bit of cardio in before the day's over other than that All's good, man. I'm excited. Uh, this is uh, this is a much better package than I brought to the show in August. I feel a lot leaner, so it's just about timing it so my peak looks good on stage. So, all right, guys, I appreciate it, and I'll uh, I'll update you again soon. All right, bye.